Hey, what is up, people? Welcome to the continuation of our playthrough. And as you guys know, we already got the origin ore. So now we gotta continue and see what we gotta do. So we got the origin ore. And we gotta continue the story, which I feel like it's taking quite some time. I gotta go to the professor, but usually that's how these games are. They take their sweet time for it to advance or progress in it. So this is the Stone of Creation beginning, the origin ore. Um, yes, yeah, certainly can feel imposing aurora emanating from it. It could this be the feeling of the very origin itself. I've been meaning to ask you since you brought that up, but the origin of what exactly? A very thing by the sound of it. Exactly, my girl. Now then, back we go to Jubilee Village. Here you are, Professor Leviton. What remains of the red chain broken? As it may be. Splendid. Even in pieces, I think we'll find this still perfectly fit for a purpose. We're generally lucky you had the foresight to pick up all these broken bits back at the temple. Your turn, Johnny. Next comes to the stone of creation's beginning. You handed over the origin ore. The fragments of the red chain collected at the great personal risk by the Pearl Clan. Then the stone of creation's beginning, which we first learned of thanks to the Diamond Clan. Now it is time for the Galaxy team to play its part and turn these items into a proper vessel. Akari, my girl, you are the one of our greatest team's greatest craftsmen. Could I ask you to do the honors? This is my true battlefield, Johnny, even if it may be safe indoors. This may take us some time. Perhaps the rest of you had best wait outside while we work. Come on, Mr. Professor. Wish they'd hurry up in there. I'm starting to suspect all of your prattling about the value of time is a cover for your own impatience. If sitting back and waiting actually saw things, I said forever because that'd be using time well being. I like this. We done it, Johnny. It's complete. I dub it the origin ball. If the message conveyed to our good clan leader can be believed, this should allow you to catch the Pokemon that has appeared at the Temple of Sinnoh. You obtain the origin ball. A singular and irreplicable Pokeball that can be used to catch the frenzy Pokemon raging at the Temple of Sinnoh. Those Pokeballs of yours are full of wonders. I to think that the fatal Hoosie could rest in something so tiny. Intrigue how catching a Pokemon in one of these things could bring the two of you closer together. Well, hold on. That voice, I hear it in my head again. You mean Dialga? Yeah. Seems like Mighty Dialga willing to lend its strength to this fight. That's what it's selling me. That's certainly excellent news. The Diamond Clan's almighty Sinnoh, or perhaps should I say Dialga, is a fearsome powerful. I think he's ready now, Johnny. Take the origin bond. Hurry up back to the Temple of Sinnoh together with Dialga. And you're here, lost one, ready to face your fate atop of the Mount Carnet. It seems a vicious battle might await you. I'll go where I must. Okay, well said. Now, hearken to my words, young one. Time cannot be severed from space nor space from time. That being you will encounter the Temple of Sinnoh is Palkia, ruler of all space. If it is allowed to run wild, space itself will wrap 
and bent here in Husi, and eventually the very world may be broken. But you have the aid of its counterpart, Dialga, the ruler of time, and therein lies hope. Balance will be brought up time and space, and the world can once be again as it should. Now take Dialga at your side and make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. I, I gotta take Dialga, I forgot. My bad. Oh my gosh, what did I do again? Why did I run there? Trying to go over here. Something about releasing Pokemon. Now I hearken to the word, young one, the time comes out. That being you will counter the temple, so, okay. Alright, I took out the Yaga. I must say this is quite an intriguing village. Perhaps I'll have a look around before I go. See what your clothier has to offer. Excuse me, this time for shopping? Well, I hardly have time for shopping if the world ends. Will I, young man? Fair point. All right, Johnny, once you feel ready, set out. We make it for the Temple Sinnoh once more. We're about to see Palkia. Just the boy I've been waiting for. I know you can buy various sundries at the base camp, but I thought it might be helpful to you if I set up here closer to the temple. 
I want to have front row seats if there is a chance to see the world of myth and legend. And I'll probably be creeping even closer to the action once the battle actually begins. But you won't have to worry about me. I'm perfectly capable of taking care of myself. And besides, I know all too well the strength of you and your Pokemon. I got no doubt you'll have this whole thing tied up in a neat bow before I could possibly be in any danger. For so long, I thought that I had to eliminate any outside element that might threaten the people of Jubilife Village. Whether that meant banishing you or seeking to destroy the Pokemon of the temple, I felt it was my only path. But you showed me that I was wrong to think in such a way. Are you ready for this challenge, recruit? I am ready for the fight. Hey, John, let's meet tomorrow together. What is that supposed to mean? It's saying we got in the Diamond Clan. It means hope you'll both stay safe. And perhaps it's worth listening to what the Diamond Clan has to say sometimes as well. We will support you in whatever way we can. Though I doubt you'll need it. John, protect Husi and her people. Protect time and space for her Pokemon. Can't believe we can actually capture both of them. Wait, why did the Ultra Boss show up? Kinda glitchy there. Oh no, I took out Palkia. I mean, Dialga, <laughs> I'm tripping. <laughs> Palkia. That's the epic battle that I wanted to see in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. What in the hell? Kinda looks like Arceus.
Oh my gosh, what the hell, bro? Nah, I want to restart it from the start. That is pretty... Crazy. That was epic, though. That time I did it easier. I don't know how I did it. He caught it. He really did. It didn't he. My eyes aren't lying right. He actually went and caught it. Yes. Oh, good show. What a catch. You contained the fearsome thing in the origin ball. Absolutely outstanding as ever, Johnny. Thanks, you know. Formidable as usual, Johnny. Hmm, yes. So even the commander sheds a tear now and then. Never thought I'd see that day. Yes, what a sight to have witnessed. Huh? Ah, oh, it was good, Commander. Not sure. Ah. Uh, deserved a sumer throw. Well, at least it seems this is no dream. Hmm. Listen up, all of you. We face a calamity unlike any we have known, but we are able to overcome it by working as one. This calls for celebration, a festival for us all. Gather your clans. This will be the greatest celebration who we see has ever had. Celebrate with the Diamond Clan. The two clans together. What about my return? Well, since so this turns out we were both following a true almighty signal of our own. I guess the times we fight 
or were those who were wrong or right? Ancient history now. I'm sure our ancestors would be shocked to see us agree. But this may well be the best path toward protecting the space we all, all share. Let us celebrate for today's dawn, a new day of all those who live in the Husi region. What about me, man? I gotta go back to my world. That the end? What the hell? How is that the end? I haven't even beat the game yet. How can that be the end? Yo, how's that the end? No way. Well, I gotta say, I did enjoy the, I did enjoy the game a lot. I think Legend Arceus was pretty dope, but I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of stuff to do via post game. But what I don't understand So, um, the, the journey is ending. I have to say this game is definitely really good. Thank you for adventuring with us. Okay, cool. Everything's cool, but what about... Your arc phone is beeping. Seek out all Pokemon.
Uh, we're gonna leave it here, and then we're gonna continue with the post games.